two years after she was diagnosed with leukemia. An 11-year-old is celebrating the end of chemotherapy. Hallelujah, right? NBC 10's Temi Topatalea shows us the special escort she received to and from Hasbro Children's Hospital. From motorcycles to horses, Enzo's escorts brought out almost every mode of transportation for 11-year-old Scotland Winfield of Narragansett. Um, we provide her with an escort coming to her from her home and into uh, her last day of, uh, of cancer treatment. And uh, it's a great day and hopefully have a great send off. Scotland and her family stepped out of their minivan covered in encouraging phrases like hashtag Scotland strong. Founder of the Hero Package Foundation, Jennifer Fonseca, made a surprise visit. Scotland was one of their first recipients. These humans are incredible. Um, I know this isn't the end of her road. Some people might think it is just because she's ending treatment. Um, she still has a while to go, and I, I just think she's going to do incredible and do incredible things, and I don't think this will be the last time we see Scotland. David Neary and his wife, both first responders, started Enzo's escorts after their son Enzo was diagnosed with leukemia and received the same special treatment a few years ago. We were hoping for the flu when my, my son was sick. I just... It's it's so there's no like big telltale sign that oh my god your kid's sick with leukemia it's it's just a punch in the chest. It's been a difficult journey for the Winfield family, but through all of the hardships, they made it to this moment. One day at a time, one minute at a time. Um, just don't focus on the fact that it's going to be two years. Just do what you can in the moment, and have faith that God's going to take care of the rest. Scotland received her last chemo treatment at Hasbro. I'm very proud, but it's like nerve wracking and like exciting and almost a little sad for some reason. It's like all of it. <laughs> While emotions are high now, the journey continues. She still has more home treatments and years of checkups, but it gets better. It's hard, but it does. A fighter showing cancer. She's the boss. In Providence, Temitok by Adelaide, NBC 10 News.